Hey guys, it's Miss Do Pink Pearl Creations again. I'm going to be doing an 18 inch wood round and I'm going to be doing the boom technique. So I'm laying down my pillow, which today is Glidden Premium, Glidden Premium Satin in Satin Finish. The base one or base A, just pure white. Get enough foam there. Okay. And I have it mixed with GAC 800 so that it helps with cracking so it doesn't crack. And let's start with our colors. Okay. I'm going to start with Van Dyke Brown, and a lot of these I don't know what the colors are, so I'm sorry. Nope, this isn't Van Dyke Brown. This one is, oh, it's a liquid text. It's Arteza. It's the something brown. Um, dang it, what is it? It's a, I know it's um. it's a, I can't remember. I'm so sorry, guys. Okay, forget that. <laughs> I don't remember the stinking name. So sorry, guys. I'm horrible. I wish I had a bit of memory, that's for sure. And here is some Golden's Gold. <laughs> this one, I know what it is. <laughs> And because this is so big, I'm doing lots of color. I love doing these big ones because it's so easy to use up all your paint that you don't need anymore or don't use, you know, to use it up. It's a great way to use it up. Okay, this one is Berry by no, oh, this one is Liquitex. I want to say it's Muted Violet. I don't work with my left hand. So we have a little bit of a problem. It's tilting. <laughs> This is a pearl white. It's a very pretty color. I love it when it's like a pearly, when it's pearl. Mm -hmm. And it has a bluish tint. I put blue, um, interference blue in it. with 
This is uh, Artist Loft's Cobalt, Metallic Cobalt Blue. I love this color. This is one of my faves. I do not remember who it's by, so I apologize. <laughs> This is Liquitex Copper. This is a beautiful color too. It's like a, it looks more like rose color to me. It's my kind of copper. <laughs> Not getting very many color on here. I'm running out of it. But it'll just give it more variety. As the colors pop through. Okay. This is a really pretty color. I can't remember what it's called, but it's by DecoArt. That's all I know there. I love this color. This color is amazing. It's like a really cool... I don't even know how to explain it, what kind of color it is. It's a... It's different. <laughs> well, I'm not being much help, sorry. <laughs> more of the screen on there. Oh, let's do let's do another interference color. This one is interference violet. The other one was interference blue.
and my paints are mixed with, sorry, I didn't even tell you guys that part. My paints are mixed with, for this recipe, they are two parts paint, untinted house paint, to one part gloss varnish, which is polycrylic. So that's what that is. And let's use this black. This is another, this is a metallic black by Artifact. Do some more of my favorite color, this green, the cobalt blue by um, Artist Loft. Love this color. Love, love, love. iridescent or interference green. Maybe we should. This is interference green. Let's give it a whirl. Slap some on there. Uh oh. No. Oh! That's huge. Okay, I have too much paint on here. We gotta blow this puppy up. some white cell activator and we'll do some black cell activator. There's some white. <laughs> I'm not sure that's going to squeeze the bottle. There's some white and then let's get the black on. using for this little piece basically it's little to me now because of all the paint that's on it okay i have to do this quick because it's going to start coming off okay so i got my blow dryer Blow in the middle where the black is, and it'll bring up all the 
cells. Just blow lightly and it'll all come up. I do recommend popping those bubbles before you blow it out though, which I didn't do. Um, now I have to, let's see, get my torch. Did you see all the bubbles that popped when I did that? Um, I think I burnt it. <laughs> okay, so we'll see as it's as it's coming up the more cells that are coming up that's what you want okay let me give it a little spin so i can blow in the middle a little bit so it's not such a deep puddle in the middle then you can get more cells to come up When I run it, when I lean over, my nose runs. <laughs> then my allergies start. The joys of allergies. So I get a turkey baster for the smaller spots that I don't want them to go really big, like the size of my mouth. So I get this turkey baster and I just blow on the spots. And if there's cells in there, they'll come out. If not, they won't get out of here for one. Sometimes you gotta keep blowing until you see the little cells. And the same come up, so it's almost like magic. Cell magic. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Okay. So everywhere that you don't like the black, just blue. Don't blow too hard because you'll blow it out. You blow it all over the place. Just lightly. See all those cells that just formed? Isn't that the coolest?
Well, that's definitely why they call it cell activator, huh? <laughs> okay, now I'm going to, is that not so cool? I love it. Okay, I'm gonna tilt it to the middle a little bit. Maybe I'll just spin it a little bit. spin it a little bit when it's so full because I don't want it to go flying everywhere. And I want to keep as many cells as I can so I don't want a lot of stuff coming off. Ooh, look how cool it's looking! Okay, let's do it again. Don't ever reach your hands over it either when they're all soaked in paint because one little drop of paint on your pretty painting, you'll be really, really sad <laughs> and disappointed. Very disappointed. Okay, I think we are almost done. I'm loving that, guys. What do you think? All right, let's bring it on for a close-up. Okay. And here we are. Look at those sails. I love the multicolor. Especially the darker ones over here are so cool. See? Just mix a bunch of colors on there and you'll be surprised at how awesome it comes out. Okay guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and stay tuned for my tip for this video. Um, actually, this is my tip, sorry. <laughs> okay, so my tip is get yourself a puppy pole. That is what my my spinner is in is a puppy pull off of Amazon. I'll link the link below. You can get any size, but I recommend the large one. That's this size. The small one, I'm not even kidding you guys, you would laugh. It is as small as a 12 foot. So one foot, or no, sorry, 12 inches. It's literally one foot big. If I can, I'll show you a picture of it if I find it. But I ordered it thinking it was going to be a pull for my thing. So definitely pay attention to the size when you order it. Definitely pay attention. Because I was thinking I was getting something pretty big. And it wasn't even big enough to put one painting in. Let alone spin it. Okay. So there you go, guys. I hope you have a fabulous day. And thanks, as always, for watching. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks so much, guys. Bye for now.